Hey Anonymi, I wanted to share something with you. I just ordered this in the mail, and um, it's a 2009 mint proof set of just the pennies. You can buy the proof sets in clad, silver, silver sets. Uh, the, I think in this year it even had three lenses full if you buy the uh, entire mint set. It includes a whole lens of all the quarters and also of all of the, the dollars, the presidential dollars, plus the normal coinage and the 09 cents. But back in 2009, you could order just the cents. As you know, in 2009, the bicentennial cents came out. The bicentennial was celebrating the 200th birthday of Abe Lincoln. So you may not know, have known, known why they originally started the, the Lincoln cent in 1909. That was the centennial. So in 2009, they commemorated the bicentennial. This year, they had these four coins issued. And uh, it was a very low mintage year. It's very collectible. On top of it being below normal mintage levels anyway, they have to split mintage between four different designs. So, compared to other pennies, they're pretty scarce. If you can find them in good condition, I recommend hanging on to them. It doesn't, it's not very different for the proofs. In fact, it's uh, just the same. People were not spending as much money in uh, 2009, and they're, they're a little more scarce than usual. So, this is a good thing to add to your collection. Something else that's kind of interesting about these 2009 pennies is that they are made of copper. And I'm going to demonstrate this. Uh, what we're going to do here might send shivers down some of your spines, but these are for my Dansko album to finish the uh, last four slots, the 2009 San Francisco slots in that album. So we're going to crack it out of this lens and push them in there. But before we do, I wanted to weigh them for you and, and show you how much they weigh. If you find them in circulation, you might be able to weigh them. We're going to compare it to a pair of the Business Strike 2009 pennies. So I'm going to get a couple of tools, crack open to this lens, and I will report back to you with gloves on, and we'll weigh these puppies. All right, as we were discussing, here are the last few slots in the book that we're trying to fill up. 2009S, I have the lens cracked open, and they are very delicately mounted inside of this foam decorative slab that was inside of the lens. So, what I'm going to do is try to do this one-handed without causing too much havoc. Push out one of these scents. Take the penny. Oops, I forgot to turn my scale on. Okay, wanted to demonstrate for you. Get the scale zeros at, zeroed out. 3.16 grams. So as you can see, that is the same weight as the classic penny that was struck in 1909. They sold these pennies as being of vintage material and also being commemorative for the 100th, 200th year of his birthday. It's pretty cool. Um, I wanted to compare it up against, just to show you what a normal business strike zinc scent would weigh in at. That is, oh, I took the paper off. That's why it's only 2.18. Gently put down my nice penny. And that's better. Right around 2.5 should be a normal zinc strike. So it is a little heavier. If you find these that are copper, they're a little more valuable. They're, they're more scarce than the uh, zinc strikes. So if you want to find this exact product, it's out there on eBay right now. You can get it for about, depending on the shipping costs and, and the cheapest one that's out there, anywhere from $9 to $11. If you're paying 20, you're probably overpaying. So go take a look. These are good collectible pennies. Uh, even if you're not a big penny collector, 2009 is a great year to collect. So go check them out. 
They are beautiful, nice designs, nice cameo. It's hard not to continue to look at them. So I wanted to share that with you guys. If you want to hit the like button and, and leave a comment down below, I'd love to hear what you guys are collecting and if you have a penny collection going. Subscribe as always, we, we love new subscriptions. That's what keeps this channel going is you guys seeing our videos in the feed and, and taking the time to watch. So we really appreciate your time. Happy hunting.